will be playing Demon Souls for the first time. Never played this game before, so let's just see what this game is all about. And yeah, let's jump right into it. So. Already looks marvelous. You can tell just by the music that this game is going to be really difficult. <laughs> I have played games like Zelda before, so I'm not sure how much, you know, that will help me in this type of game. But damn, this game just looks beautiful. There we have it, Dragoon! I just call Dragon's Dragoon. Damn! I literally felt like I watched a trailer for this game. Press any button. Let us go. So now I will be wanting to play in actual performance mode because I do prefer the 60 frames. And yeah, let's jump right into it. We'll be playing offline. Okay, so this is the character selection screen. It definitely go as a male. My question, okay, so I'm gonna name myself Ace. That's my gaming name. Okay, and then um, what should we choose? Generally, I like knights in general. So knight class is rather advanced. Area of Southern Bolternia. Fit of a sturdy armor and adept close combat. So I really like close combat. So I might actually go for the knight. I get all these guys are like. Um, yeah, I think I just think I'm gonna go for the knight. Okay, fire damage. I, I like the HP stuff, so. Um, okay, foundation. Okay, so that's how he walks. One, and what's the difference? <laughs> what's the difference? So that's, okay, I, I, so one, he's leaning forward, and one, he's standing more upright. Let's see. No, I don't want a female voice. Uh. I can't tell the difference. I'm just gonna go for D. Appearance, okay. Ah, he actually looks pretty, 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 pretty dope. Uh, okay, I'm not gonna go for any presets, but damn, damn, these look great. Over, like, these look so good right off the bat. Hey, he looks like Jon Snow. Maybe I'll look, make my character look like Jon Snow. So let's just like edit on top of him. Okay, so then go to the skin, make it a little darker. Yeah, make it that. And let's see his age. Uh, he can go all the way to up to 80. That's actually pretty nice. Um, Alright, so we'll make him around. We'll make him my age. There we go. Uh, there we go. Now his way. <laughs> okay. 
so that's that. Um, so this face. Uh, 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 oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I like. Hey, 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 hey. Damn, this is so um, specific. Okay. Very specific indeed. Let's make it a little smaller. Maybe give it a little depth. Yep. Let's give him some. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, those are nice. Um, fridge. Yeah, make them a little bushier. Higher. Okay, so that's that. Eyes. Hey, you look like a little princess. Uh, I can spend ages on the screen, but uh, let's just go for something simple like. Uh, There we go, we'll go for that. And I'll actually give you, yeah, I'll give you normal eyes, and I'll make your eyes blue in color. And secondary color should be blue. There we go. And maybe a slight bit of glow. And depth, I can't really tell. So ears, I'm just gonna keep the ears the same. The nose, what can we do for the nose? So that looks good. That looks kind of better though. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, I like that. That looks nice. Okay, I'm just gonna keep that the way it is. Maybe I'll make his bridge a little smaller. Like that. Awesome. This is his mouth. His actual mouth. That's nice. I like that one. For his jaw, we will give him... Nope. Yep, that is for his jaw. Make it more deep and give him some cheekbones. Because it's winter, right? Oh, oh god. So his hair, I actually like the hair from before, so I'm just going to keep this hair. And then his facial... Oh, I actually liked his... Uh, you know, I'm gonna keep what was there from before. Maybe I can give him a bit more... Uh, it's a bit too brushy, is it? No, that's, that's, that's nice. And then, let's see... Uh, <laughs> you can put makeup on. <laughs> That's pretty nice. No, I just want him to be standard Jon Snow. Is that... Does that look like Jon Snow? Um, you know, maybe give him some... <laughs> I'm just gonna give him that. There we go. Okay, and that is our character, and I'm gonna finalize that. King Alant the Twelfth, by channeling the power of souls, brought unprecedented prosperity to his northern kingdom of Boletaria. That is, until the colorless deep fog swept across the land. Boletaria was cut off from the outside world, and those who dared penetrate the deep fog never returned. But Valifax of the royal twin fangs broke free from the fog and told the world of Boletaria's plight. But the old King Alant had roused the old one, the great beast below the nexus, from its eternal slumber, and that a colorless fog had swept in, unleashing terrible demons. The demons hunt down men and claim their souls. Those who lose their souls lose also their minds. The mad attack the sane and chaos reigns. Valifax also spoke of the enticing power of the demon souls. 
Each time a demon claims a human soul, the demon's own soul is invigorated by the life force, and the power of a mature demon soul is beyond human imagination. The legend spread quickly. Mighty warriors lured by the possibilities braved the fisher to breach the accursed land. But none have returned. Wow. Pure of the twin fangs. Yet the silent chief. Saint Urbane. Skurva the Wanderer. The sixth Saint Astraea with her knight Gal Vinland. And Sage Freak the Visionary. The colorless deep fog slowly creeps beyond Boletaria's borders. Humankind faces a slow and steady extinction. The deep fog will eventually swallow all lands near and far. But Boletaria has one final hope. A lone warrior who has braved the baneful fog. That's oh, us. Has the land found its savior? Or have the demons found a new slave? Brave soul who fears not death. I shall guide you to the fissure. You can actually feel the water underneath you. Haptic feedback is insane. So that you may lull the old one back to slumber. All right, let's get started. Oh god, I just used an item. Okay, so how do I attack? So R1 is standard attack. Okay. His roll is actually pretty slow. That's alright. Maybe you can upgrade that, you know, while playing. Alright, so directional sprint is... Okay, so we press L1 to guard. Seems pretty straightforward. Okay. Oh, I didn't see him there. Okay. Okay, so we can lock on our target R3. Oh, God. There we go, we've already lost a bit of health. I'm not sure if that's a bad thing. There we go. Right, so these guys, if you can just like smash through them. And then you got the strong attack, I think. I wonder if there's like combos. Oh, wait, there was something there. Message. Okay, so we can use our item, which we did, and we can switch it, pressing that. Okay. Cool. Examine his... Oh, uh, use the item and mistake again. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, so we can vault over... Okay. Back step. Okay. Okay, this back step is. I like the back step. You can just jump back. Okay, but it's based on your stamina as well. Cool. Yeah. 
Interesting. So maybe guard and shield when your stamina is low. I'm just thinking of what I can do. Okay, so if I do a dash attack, maybe that does some more damage? I am not sure. Hey, what's down here? Okay. Ooh, some health item. I like exploring places, so I just like to like clean them out properly. Okay, so then go here. So this is called an ox stone. The Fallen Outpost. Okay. <laughs> okay, so that's a strong attack. Hey, human enemies. Oh, oh, God, God, God. Okay. Right, it's a parry. L2. So, repose. Right, I'm gonna try a parry. And parries are generally considered, you know, more complex and timing based, but. Oh god. I wanna try it, I wanna try it, I wanna get one. Ah, there we have it. Awesome! So, parries are risky because you gotta time them. But if you actually nail them, then you get a good reward. I mean, you get a really strong attack. Okay, I'm gonna try to learn parries. Oh, oh, oh my god! Oh god, oh god. Oh, no! It's just, I, I don't have... Oh, dude, my health. My health. Okay, 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 okay. <sighs> One more time. Okay. <laughs> Real weapon with both hands, okay. So we can't parry with... Can we? So we, okay, so we can't parry with a double-handed. But let's try this. The trailers made it look so easy. I, I want to go back to Sword and Shield. Damn! So what's this? Okay, so you can, if you're a lefty, then you can go like that. If you're a righty, you can... Actually, I'm not sure, but I, I like my current configuration. Okay. Okay, um, we climb the stairs and then make, oh, so we can actually, so we can lock, okay. So running takes stamina. And back seven. Okay. Examine corpse. Whoa, 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 who are you? Okay. 
This game requires a lot of concentration. Damn. Alright, let's go. Oh my god. Run, run away, run away, run away, run away! Oh god! My god, I didn't even last a second there! Holy sh. Holy. Soul of the lost withdrawn from its vessel. I didn't even. <laughs> what? So the world might be mended. Okay. So I cannot escape. However, capturing the souls, okay? Well, you slipped through the fissure too, did you? You came for demon souls. Or to save this land and be remembered as a hero. <laughs> Hunting for demons? Try one of the arch stones. Now go. That is why you came, is it not? To this accursed Politaria. Okay, so... This is the Nexus. And we have these Arc Stones. So we go in front of one of these. And... It's like a teleportation type of thing. Can we just... Can we go to them in any order? No. So we have to go to this one first. All right. Those loading times are just amazing, spectacular. Ah, uh, Dragoon. Okay, so we are at the gates of Boltaria. Okay, let's down here. I'm just actually curious to see what the weapons do. I mean, the items, so... Consumes slight HP, reasonable, great, over time, poison... Relinquishes all souls to return to the Nexus. Consume to gain souls. Okay. So, just trying to. Okay. So, there's an arc stone right there. Before I get that, I'll actually- Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. In fact, maybe I will touch this arc stone. Let's see what very what happens. Oh, no, it takes us back to- No! Wait, oh, 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 patience, 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 patience. I am doing something. Don't interrupt. I'm trying to see what this does. Okay, so it basically allows us to return to the Nexus.
acá, eh. Damn, that's sad. I need to practice uh, parrying. Okay, let's practice parrying against these weaker enemies. Oh god! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Damn! So if I just guard against these weaker enemies, they can't do anything? Oh god! there for a second. Oh, oh, here we have one more guy. Whew. Let's try parrying again. that okay I don't know what's down there but I am not gonna go down there oh 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 careful man don't give me jump scares like that Two parts, I'm not sure which goes with so this is just like two Damn this game is scary. Wait, so they're humans, and the humans are teaming up with these, like, monster type of things? Interesting. Alright, who are you, man? Alright, we can just cruise through them. Oh god! Ugh. Who's shooting that? I have no clue who's shooting that. Up or down? I have... Oh! No, 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 no. 
So that's where that guy was kind of shooting at me from. Why did I consume that? I do not know. Can I go there? I can. And... I cannot go down there. I mean, there might be a way, but I'm not sure. Oh, God! Oh, 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 whoa, 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 bro! Calm it down! from the start. I'll cry. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you absolutely kidding me? Are you absolutely kidding me? Do I have to start all the way from here again? You gotta be kidding me. This game is brutal. underestimate this game. So then, from there... come this far, we can, no we can't vault over that. Right. 
your hand. I've actually gone significantly further than what I did last time. Okay. Dude, there's so many of them. Wait, 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 wait. I need a heal. far as we can get as close as them and okay dude I hear a boss <laughs> I've actually gotten quite far. Okay, keep your guard up. Okay. So for the spearmen, first block and then attack. Whew. 
Okay. Just don't trigger one of them. God, did you see that? Oh damn, oh damn, you're a good. I want to stay in the outdoors. Whew. All right. So stressful. What is that? What is that? I don't want to die. 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 Holy crap. I, I actually don't want to die. Oh. Am I close? I think I'm close to the boss. Okay, we 
gain stamina. And then go to him. This is a weird ass boss, man. Another weird ass uh, enemy, man. Oof. this place up so I, if I die I can just oh how good is that how good is that oh oh so if I die I can just like ah oh, that's awesome that's actually amazing that's amazing Hopefully it is amazing. I, I really hope, you know. Go. Oh, we open the main gate. We open the main gate. That's such a big blade. Oh, my God. Okay, so this boss, we're gonna basically walk around the little slimes. Work our way around him. Hit, dodge. How about that? Hit, dodge. So we gain our health. Dodge. Strong attack. Oh god. Strong attack. Okay, I need a healing item. Oh god. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay. three of them. This guy is getting smaller. Progress, but slow progress. Maybe heal. Okay. Okay, we're getting there. It's getting weaker. We're getting close. Okay, I think we're pretty close. Just take one healing item for safety. One more, one two more. Okay, I, I hope nothing happens when I kill this guy. So how do I kill this big slime guy now? Get him here? There we go. We killed it. Oh, God. <laughs>